Okay, hey, hey, we are back. Helpers, thanks, and I'll click us into position, and I'll just say this. I didn't like it that my cousin and I got into that squabble about the squalid conditions in the ghetto. Ooh. Squabble. Okay. A disagreement. A little disagreement. Okay. A squabble. Squabble. We were arguing about the squalid conditions. Squalid. Run down and dirty. Squalid. And then ghetto. Ooh. A rundown area in a big city. Okay. Ghetto. It wasn't good. My cousin and I got into a squabble about the squalid conditions in the ghetto. Oh, ooh, look at this nice pizza here. Oh. Our guests will be sad when there's only five pieces of pizza left. Oh, oh, well, only five, that's fine, but wait a minute, George says. Pieces are, so there's pieces? There is pieces? No, there are pieces, there are five pieces. Right, George. There you go. Here it is. Our guests will be sad when there are only five pieces of pizza left. Marcelo wiggles restlessly whenever he's asked to join in at a type of folksy dance. Yeah, down home, informal, oh, square dance, yes, that a folksy dance, folksy, yeah. Oh, and Marcelo squirms when he has to perform at a square dance. Marcelo squirms whenever he's asked to join in at a square dance. You can't catch a large sea fish in this scary, severe storm gust on a body of water. Oh, oh, look at that. Oh, that's a squid. Ah, a squid. You know, how are you going to catch a squid in this squall? Right. A severe storm gust out on the water. You can't catch a squid in this scary squall. I'm slightly confused about whom will win the election. Oh, you can, you can hear that one. Whom will win? No, he will win. So, uh, the one without the M, who, right, about who will win the election. I'm slightly confused about who will win the election. Miriam makes a sound of pain whenever she gets pressed upon too hard for neck therapy. Ah, it's nice, but oh, when the Masseuse presses too hard. Yeah. Then there's some pain. Ooh, masseuse. Person giving a massage, right? Miriam squawks whenever she gets squeezed too hard, okay? Miriam squawks whenever she gets squeezed too hard for neck therapy. Let's stop completely, the demonstrators, before they make a sound like the word squeak again. Oh, there that is again. 
Who Asa from a while back? He knows this fancy term for it. Onomatopoeia. Yeah. The condition of a word sounding just right for what it means. Oh, stop completely. Squelch before they squeak. Squeak. Let's squelch the demonstrators before they squeak again. Will Marla and Julia get blown off their horses in the March wind? Oh, well, I don't think so, but uh, I'm beginning to wonder, okay? Hold on tightly, Julia, Marla. To party extensively. Oh, to party hardy. Hey, hey. Oh, yeah, there you go, Marcelo. To kick up our heels. Oh, come Friday night. Thank God it's Friday. We plan to kick up our heels. It now looks like Julia won't finish her latest landscape till March. Oh, well, Julia, oh, she says that she has other obligations. Okay, all right. But wait a minute. Looks like Julia won't. There you go. We can put in as if. It works with as if, so we must do it. It now looks as if Julia won't finish her latest landscape till March. Won't finish her latest landscape till March. Our catcher gets sore knees when he crouches behind the base that isn't square. Oh, well, there's, well, that's first base, okay? First base, second base, third base, Hey, home plate. No. Yeah. Oh, when he squats. Yeah. Yes. The other bases are square. Home plate is not. Our catcher gets sore knees when he squats behind the base that isn't square. Church regrets arousing the those that sneak around a property by calling them hoodlums. Yeah, George, yeah, don't provoke them to more violence, okay? Oh, there it is, provoking, provoking the prowlers, okay? Calling them names, George. George regrets provoking the prowlers by calling them hoodlums. There's a young man on my block that can speak six languages. Ooh, ooh. Marla says it. Oh, the block can speak six languages? No, oh, the man. Okay, so we have to get man right in front of that. Okay, okay, we'll do your trick, Marla. Out at the beginning, okay? Yeah, get that stuff out at the beginning, out of the way. On my block, there is a young man that can speak six languages. And there's man immediately in front of that. During COVID, Luke had the good judgment to sing some Bible songs. Oh. oh, yes, the, the prudence, the good judgment, the wisdom. Yeah, to sing some psalms, right, Miriam? Yeah, silent L, psalms. During COVID, Luke had the prudence to sing some psalms. Prudence, psalms. I have more skill in eating fruit 
than I do in eating dates. Oh, now wait a minute here. What kind of fruit? Oh, prunes. Prunes, right. Oh, and up top? Prowess. Prowess. I have more prowess in eating prunes than I do in eating dates. Prowess, prunes. Does Julia do any portraits or abstract paintings? Oh, do you, Julia? Oh, she says no. Oh, strictly landscapes. Oh, okay. To highly impress them. Oh, to really show them some wonderful stuff. Oh, uh, idiom man. To knock their socks off. Oh, when I perform, I will knock their socks off. And for discussion, a sickness, a time when you were sick. Yeah. Compare notes with your advanced English learner friends on that. You know, the sicknesses that all of you have had through the years, okay? Not all of them, and we talking for too long a time, okay? But a, a notable sickness. The state government reported 11 incidences of infection in our neighborhood. Uh oh, there it is. Incidences. Ah, oh, church. Incidents. Yes, happenings. Occurrences. Okay, just incidents. The state government reported 11 incidents of infection in our neighborhood. Incidents. He could excite himself up with the pen name Mark Twain. Oh, and Julia, here she is. She knew I'd ask the real name. Uh, all right, Samuel. Oh, she says the middle name too. Langhorn. Samuel Langhorn Clemens. Mark Twain. Oh, he could psych himself up with a pseudonym, right, Julia? Oh. He could psych himself up with the pseudonym Mark Twain. By the third session, the doctor for the mind had reached deeply into my mind, right? Oh, my psyche, yes. And who did it? Marla, yes, the psychiatrist, okay? Yeah, can prescribe medicine, so psychiatrist, yeah, a medical doctor. By the third session, the psychiatrist had reached deeply into my psyche. Sandra grows flowers equally as well as Bachman's, yeah, the big nursery Bachman's. Huh. Sandra grows flowers equally as well as Bachman's. Ooh, yeah, right, Miriam. We don't need equally, and so we get rid of it. Sandra grows flowers as well as Bachman's. I live in the nearby area of the old overly proper person, but I won't dig into her private business, okay? Oh, I'm in the proximity, yes, Randy, proximity of the old prude, yeah, overly proper person, but I won't pry, I won't pry into her private business. I live in the proximity of the old prude, 
but I won't pry into her private business. Proximity, prude, pry. Next Tuesday, because of my trip to San Diego, I will vote by substitute. Oh yeah, in voting, okay, the substitute for voting, proxy, right. Good one, Miriam, proxy. Next Tuesday, because of my trip to San Diego, I will vote by proxy. Does Chorch like marmalade more than apricot jam? Oh, he doesn't. I don't blame him. Yeah. Okay, the, the marmalade is okay, but I prefer the apricot jam. George, I'm with you. It's more easily said than done. Yeah, we can talk, talk, talk a good game, but oh, oh, oh idiom man. Talk is cheap. I'm going to do something. Talk is cheap. I could have swam forever in the clear ocean water. Oh, oh, look at that. A young lady kissing a dolphin. Wow. Yeah. Oh, I could have swam, George? Right. Swam. I could have swum. George, go ahead. Today I swim. Yesterday I swam. And for weeks I have swum. Swim, swam, have swum. Somebody wrote arousing words on the new boat's front end of a boat. Oh, yeah, the new boat's prowl. Yeah. Oh, and arousing, okay, stirring up. Provocative, right, Asa? Provocative words. Somebody wrote provocative words on the new boat's prowl. Yeah, just to stir up trouble. Provocative words. Mariana will spray the rodent that can climb a tree. <laughs> we know that one, don't we, Randy? Yeah. So that it stops chewing on our shed. Oh, yeah, the squirrel. Mariana will squirt the squirrel with water. Mariana will squirt the squirrel so that it stops chewing on our shed. All of the sudden, uh, uh, uh. Oh, Marla? Yes. Never, the, always, a. Uh. Never, all of, the, sudden. Always, all of, a, sudden. Right. All of a sudden, Teacher Don decided to take a flight to Denver. All of a sudden. Julia went to the shelter for horses to check the strength to stay in place of her horse's water trough. Oh, yeah, you wouldn't want the water trough to tip over, right? Yeah, so she went to the stable to check the stability of the trough. Stable stability. Julia went to the stable to check the stability of her horse's water trough. Our entire team of workers walked on to the raised front area for performers. Oh, we know that one, Miriam. Stage, yes, and above it, staff. 
no, the entire staff. Our entire staff walked onto the stage. Staff, stage. How good are you at painting and wallpapering? Uh, I'm not, not too bad at it. Yeah, I've done a fair amount of both. Okay, yeah. And the more you do it, the better you get. Not yet free of danger. Okay, now it's still in a little bit of risk. Or, idiom man, not out of the woods. Yes, okay. I'm supposed to get out of the hospital soon. I'm not quite out of the woods yet. I'm not out of the woods. Oh, and our last page for this video 175. It was the last game of the World Series, so no one was disinterested. Uh-oh. Yeah, not talking about financial involvement. Yeah, curiosity, right? Uninterested, right, Church? No one was uninterested. It was the last game of the World Series, so no one was uninterested. She had marks on her blouse after she walked unsteadily out of the strawberries. Oh, she must have gotten dizzy there in the sun while she was picking strawberries. Uh, she had stains on her blouse, yes. And, oh, Miriam, staggered, yes. Uh, staggered out of the strawberries. Miriam, the whole thing. She had stains on her blouse after she staggered out of the strawberries. Good one, Miriam. We can make unwobbly the stock market after we fix our not growing economy. Oh, no, we can make unwobbly, Randy. Yeah, we can stabilize the stock market. Yeah, we can make it strong, okay, not wobbly. Uh, stagnant, right, our stagnant economy, not growing. We can stabilize the stock market after we fix our stagnant economy. With injuries on his chest, Henry bleated for 45 minutes. Oh, charge. Yeah, not bleated, right? Bled. Yeah, bled. Today I bleed, yesterday I bled, and for days I have bled. Bleed, bled, have bled. When you get to the outdoor arena, pile up the unused chairs. Oh, there's a stack of chairs there on the right for extra seating, okay? Yeah, when you get to the stadium, stack up the unused chairs. Now, yeah, pile them up. When you get to the stadium, stack up the unused chairs. Stadium, stack. My uncle seems to be too proper for attending a for men only party. <laughs> he seems to be too staid, right, Marcelo? Staid, your uncle staid to attend a stag party. Yeah, for men only. My uncle seems to be too staid for attending a stag party. Staid, stag. 
Will Julia be taking her puppy to church for a second blessing? Oh, oh, look at this yellow lab. Yeah, yeah, he's ready to be blessed again. A nuisance. Yeah, a big inconvenience, okay? A big bother. Or, oh, Asa. A pain in the neck. That's getting to be a pain in the neck. Doing these taxes year after year. My tax return. Mm, a pain in the neck. What a nuisance. That is, yes, it. Video 175. So helpers, let... Oh, oh, oh you, you want to wait yet? Okay. All right, well then, okay, when you come back, we'll do one more, and then lunch, then lunch, okay? So that was 175, and uh, when we see you again, everybody, it'll be video 176. See you then, okay? Bye-bye.